Good morning. Today is August the 3rd, and this is Pastor Rick's Reflections. Today we're going to dive into a theological term from Crazy Talk. And uh, this one um, happens to be blessing. I don't think I've done this before. If I have, then I guess you're blessed to hear it again. Ooh, cheesy. I know. Bad joke. Anyway, blessing. The act or, or words by which one bestows favor on someone who certainly hasn't earned it but probably thinks he deserves it or an action or gift that is a sign of divine favor. Sometimes words do something. Consider the difference between these two scenarios. Scenario number one, it's Friday night and your friends invite you out for pizza. You ask your spouse or parent if you can go. There's a slight pause, after which the answer comes without enthusiasm. Go ahead. Scenario two, it's Friday night. Your friends invite you out for pizza. Or you ask your spouse or parent if you can go. There's a slight pause, after which the answer comes with enthusiasm. Go ahead, have a good time. The difference between scenario one and scenario two, besides the fact that your chances of experiencing scenario two are better if your room is clean and you did the dishes. Well, what is the difference in scenario one? You got permission, which means that you can go, but you might have to pay for it later. In scenario two, you got a blessing, which means that God's face has shown upon you. God blesses us in two ways. First, God blesses us directly when God gives us undeserved gifts, like a sunny day, a good friend, uh, a fresh apple pie. Second, God blesses us indirect, indirectly when we speak words or do actions that bless others, like this commonly used benediction. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord's face shine upon you and be gracious to you. May the Lord look upon you with favor and grant you peace. Now, go try to be a blessing since you are blessed to be a blessing. Let us pray. Good and gracious God, you bless us in so many ways. The gifts that you share with us are beyond anything that we deserve. But because you love us so much, you enthusiastically shower us with with gift upon gift. Help us to continue to realize that we are blessed to be a blessing, uh, that you put us here to share our love and our gifts with the world around us so that they may know your love. Help us to continue to do what we can uh, throughout this pandemic. Help us to bless others by doing what is safe and right, uh, by taking care of one another, not just... uh, concerning COVID, but help us take care of one another when it comes to being there for the sick, the lonely, the homeless, the hungry. Continue to watch over us uh, and, and help us to know what we should do each day. Keep us always in your care and remind us of your love. In Christ's name we pray. Amen.